Hello, MechWarriors. How's it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. Today, guys, I want to bring this guy to life. We have the Timber Wolf and we have the weapons to outfit the good boy. However, there's one very interesting mission here that I want to play beforehand. And this one is our kind of fortress assault mission. For that, I will quickly repair everything I have. Repair all. Let's go. And I, I just hope that we can get things done. I also probably need that atlas at some point. Like, seriously. But hey, let's go in and uh, have a good time on the battlefield with a fortress um, exploration assault mission. Exploration fortress assault. We're gonna go for maximum salvage and I think damage coverage. Because I will probably get a lot of damage here in, in general. Because we will be fighting a and lot of enemy mechs. We will be fighting will be a lot of ravager there. turrets and, and it's not gonna be easy. And you know what? I really feel like this is my squad. Um, I want to probably play the... Huh. Is it the Grasshopper, actually? I'm thinking. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I feel like, yeah, getting fire support from the Orion is good. It's four large lasers, bunch of AMS. We have, like, no ECM, right? Not really. I mean, we're pretty good against missiles. With all of the AM. Wait, Guardian ECM is on the Orion. Alright, so in that case, I will take the Orion here. Mm, are we gonna take Kenny? Where are you, Kenny? It's so not visible. I don't like it. So this is Kenny in bay number two. You're my best missile pilot that I have. I'm just gonna do it like that so I have like full control over my first mech when I drop on the battlefield. Alright, so, ready to go. We're gonna launch in two seconds. It's not gonna be easy. Again, lots of mechs, lots of Ravager turrets. We need to wear the enemies down with our long range, I believe. So charging them is probably not a good idea. And we gotta keep in mind we have a fighter jet. That's gonna help us. So, in we are going to go. I think I'm gonna get this guy in already. So these are the guys that we have to get the data from. It's pretty good. Here comes our flyer. Alright. Oh, big lag. Doesn't mean we have some enemies coming in. Oh, there's there's dropships dropping. Oh, yes. Alright, here's the first guy. We are... Missing our first shot, that's for sure. Um, we're gonna try to wear him down, then move in, get the data and get out again. That's the plan here. Alright, lots of laser beams. I have no vision yet. The stuff on the left side Target though. Acquired. Um, alright, let's take the party sound first. Oh, there's another assault mech. Um, uh, party sound down. Yeah, let's go for the left guy here. Target. It's a crap! Oh, it's a freaking skin crap! No! Um, I mean, wear it down, but don't destroy it yet. Hold fire. Oh, hold fire. We gotta hack him first. There's more coming from the side. You can. Target acquired. Ah! Come on, hack this guy. Hack it! Come on! We need it now! That VTOL is on our list of uh, How close do we have to get? There we go. Data transfer complete. complete! That's what I want to hear. More assault may coming from the left and side. And it's a freaking longbow. I mean, missiles are not that big of a concern. Let's go ahead and attack the awesome again. Oh god, I took a lot of damage already. I'm also... Eh, come on. Not really, not really fast right now. Hold fire, guys. Hold fire. We need this guy alive. <gasps> Should I send him over? To the other side already? I don't feel like it. Come on! Push it, push it hard! Oh, this guy is getting attacked by our flyer. But I think that's fine. What do we need? 150 meters? Hack him! Alright, kill him. Good. Good. Good, good, goody good. So, now, we are going for freaking Annihilator. What? What? Also, night vision. Okay, and he needs to go, and he needs to go quickly. I'm gonna completely dump everything on the big assault mech. 100 ton of destruction, lots of auto cannons. Uh, we're gonna wear him down with the missiles. It's perfectly fine if my friends are not doing anything right now. I wanna keep him safe. That's any down. Nice. Cool, where's the base? It's actually quite close. Target acquired. SRM turret, light mech, a raven, classic raven. All right, pretty good. 
Um, our guy is slightly damaged. Catapult. See, again, I don't really want everybody to move in there yet. I think we're gonna use our range advantage to wear the enemies down before we all assault that base. It's getting a little laggy. We lose locks. On the turrets, then. I see you, big turret up top. But we gotta take the others down beforehand. Come on, take him. Very good. I also need to think about my my overall. Oh, they have another king crab. Um, ammunition count. How much can a longbow take? We'll figure it out. Um, actually. Negative. No target. Ah, I lost target right here. Copy. All right, I'm gonna send him in uh, now for the catapult. And I myself will attack the freaking Ravager turret. We got the range advantage here. I know the enemy assault mix are closing in as well. But let's stay on the guy up top. Oh, that is scary. Come on. Pull back a little. More. Even more. Okay, we got him. Now, on the king freaking crap. King crabs are really good targets for us because they have big center torso hitboxes. Um, and we even got a headshot. Pretty good. Medium lasers to the face. Alright, Hunchbot down. Highlander is probably next. Yeah, we're gonna go for him. Medium lasers. Every point of damage that we can get out of here now. Only one shot here. Pretty good. Light mag. Mm, not really one of my targets, no. Let's not do it. Looking good so far, though. Can we get a headshot on the cataract? Alright, so, uh, again. Guys, hold fire. I want to get that LRM turret before it shoots us to pieces. I know that there's a raven coming, but I don't really care. Okay. The missiles are flying. We're down to 500 missiles, though. It's not a lot. Maybe we can swap to another mech. I think our Orion did a wonderful job getting the early game going here. Another one. Oh, let's not waste any time. What's this in front of us? I don't know. <laughs> hey, Raven. I will only use my lasers here, hoping that my friends can help me out a little bit. And they do. It's another cat. It's another PPC turret. And yes, now we have the UAV up. And we know that there's a Ravager right here. Okay. I'll go for it, shooting it indirectly. And I think as soon as we got the Ravagers down, we are... We're going in. Our flyer is badly damaged. Do we care? Oh, getting shot. Oh no, oh no. That's a problem. It's a big problem. We have a lot of problems here. Okay, I need to swap to another mech. And I think it's gonna be my friend, the Thunderbolt. Also going for night vision. Thunderbolt sustained a lot of damage as well already. Why are we not hitting? What, 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 what? What, what, what is happening? Where are my missiles going? Alright, we got that guy, question mark? It's looking all right. We're gonna try to get the big turrets down. Stay away from the guys on the right side. Okay. Slow and steady. So I believe we have him. This is an SRM turret, it's irrelevant. Okay, so. Oh yeah, vehicle down. So we are capturing the base already. Ah, oh, we lost our flying unit. Ah, oh, God. I guess it's okay. Yeah, maybe I should have pulled it back. But I guess it's okay. Uh-huh. Just capture. Just capture. Got some flyers coming in. Let's get him. Missiles. Got one, got two. We did get the we did get the third one. Alright, still capturing 35%. Now it's continuing. What do we have here? Wyvern. We gotta keep the enemies out of our capture circle. That's all we need to do. So destroy them at all costs. 
pushing forward. Those medium and large lasers are actually doing a thing. Actually, just the large laser at that range. All right, 56%. There are enemies in range somewhere. Now we're capturing again. What are you trying to attack there? I don't really want to spend the time. No, let's get the stuff and get out of here. And it's a shame that we lost the flyer. Um, at the same time, I mean, we can get another one. It's not the... Actually, it is a big deal. <laughs> Never mind. It is an actual big deal. I'm still not used to using them, but um, we will get some very good items because of the help of this guy here. So, oh, sacrifices no, have been made. But... Are we... Yes, we are automatically going for you back. It's a trade-off, I'd say. It's a trade-off. Okay. Fortress mission done. It was pretty easy, actually. It was slow and steady. Um, we took our time dealing with the base defenses at long range. So that was really what kept us going there. Uh, and yes, we can take some very nice parts here. Good old King Crab is totally available to us. We have 75 picks. Highlander is a thing I don't really enjoy. LRM damage enhancement. Hmm. What's the crab getting here? Length and barrel, auto cannon damage enhancement. Maybe it's a crab. Actually, maybe it's annihilator. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I want an annihilator. Totally. Got a nice awesome here. We got a cataphract. We got a classic catapult with weak head armor. If you see tier four, don't mind if I do. Hunchback, Wyvern, Classic Raven. EW countermeasures would be nice to get, actually. But we only have four parts, so I don't really care. Uh, there's an active probe. Actually, no, this whole EW stuff is not really weight efficient. These are. That's really good. These LRM5s, that is. Ace jump jets, lasers, single heat sinks, like a lot. Alright, so six picks left. I might want to take this PPC tier 4. No, tier 3, actually. And then something. Let's say that AMS here. Alright. So, on top of all of these goodies, we're gonna get... A Marauder 3M. An Annihilator 2A. A Cyclops 10P. An LRM 20 Stream Tier 5. One Large Pulse. No, two Large Pulse. Tier 2 and four Double Heat Sinks. As well as eight million C bills. I would say... That was good. That was absolutely fantastic. Alrighty, guys. So we have six upgrade points. Where want, do I want to go, actually, with this? Armor refit cost? Structure refit? I honestly don't know. Maybe we get the mech bay upgrade number two, so we can actually run a sold max. Human resource is also pretty nice. Politics is not necessary. Discount? Open the black market? Ah, it's too expensive. I don't really care about accommodations because I drop at maximum or at yeah maximum tonnage all the time. I'm never going over or rarely going over. Yeah, the mech bays. I mean, we get some assault. Maybe we have some assault mechs now. We should probably invest into that. All right. Kablab. So there's that. Endo adjustment. Structural refits are 20% faster, but 10% more expensive. Um, sure. Actually, nah, I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna hold on to my points. Alright, guys. All of a sudden, our mech bay is filled with all of these things. Holy crap. I need to prioritize now. We certainly want to get rid of the Warhawk. But, um, without even trying, we got our hands on an Annihilator, guys. Um, okay, it's easy to maintain. 20% reduced everything, cost and time. Distracting, chance to completely avoid fire, 5%. And then this one is the LBX Auto Cannon Enhanced one. We have 25% less spread, 25% more projectile speed, 25% better cooldown, 25% less heat, 25% more damage, and then 25% more range, as well as more ammo per bin, and... 25% less beam duration? Um, somebody was going a little bit overboard with this. 
Uh, but anyway, I like it. Oh, it might be the medium pulse laser beam duration that they wanted to go for, but somebody was just copy pasting. <laughs> I don't know. But hey, eh, it's it's an Annie, and I'm very happy about that. That's a pretty good mech, and we're gonna make something happen with that. Currently, we we only have an Inner Sphere XL engine. I want the Clan XL on this guy, and then we're gonna go nuts with auto cannons, but not right now. All right. The other thing we wanted to do is um. Uh, where is the thing? Down here, Coyote. Aerospace fighter. Yes, we lost our multi-purpose fighter. It's alright. We're gonna find another one. I don't want to play Solaris right now. We are going to an industrial hub. And we will have a good time there as well. Um, also, aerospace capture contract. Tier 60 only. So, we could totally get something done there. Also, a hero mech. Oh, okay. I'm getting overwhelmed by my options now. We have to do it bit by bit. Oh boy. Three million sea bills pay. Yeah, I should have probably dropped mine in fresh, freshly acquired mechs uh, to cold storage. So, this is the Ember. Ember is not really that great, but let me take a look. Um, we have the fire starter bonus for more flamer heat damage. More range. Ember also gets 10% armor and structure. 30% better jump jet stuff. Less burn time, less fuel regen time, less heat. So this is kind of like a nimble jumper. We have 75% more damage from machine guns. It has four of them, so it's not bad. Range is less. I don't really care. And it has less ammo. So it's just bleh, more machine gunnery. Uh, less flamer damage, but way more range. 65% for the flamers. So yeah, it's, it's nice to... Get something going here with overheating and then shredding with machine guns. But it's not a thing I want to do right now. Let's go ahead and take a look at our battle max Because that's what I'm here for. Okay, we said we wanted to drop the Warhawk. Let's uh, salvage the PPC. Salvage the heatsink kit. Yeah, sure. It's good. Clan ammo is fantastic. One double heatsink is doable, workable. I think I also want the Pharaoh. Takes us two million. And it seems like we have to drop the engine to start the work. Why are we not able to? Double heatsink has a missing requirement. Ah, okay. Revert real quick. Okay, we drop these. We drop the heatsink kit. And with that, we also have to drop every single double heatsink that is broken. So that we have a viable, viable mech. Correct? Engine destroyed. Conflict with double heat sinks. Oh, there's an actual good one. And still not start the work. What's going on here? Double heat sink missing requirement. So either I'm blind or we have another heat sink somewhere. I don't see it, honestly. Alright, no heatsink here, no heatsink here, no heatsink here, no heatsink here. Z this is a targeting computer, this is an engine, that's a, an LRM. Weird. This thing is empty. Like, it's completely empty. Um, uh, I don't want to spend 3.2 million C bills. Alright, so in that case, we're gonna keep the heatsink kit there. No, we can't. We can't. It has too many violations. We have to completely strip it. Not the armor. Not the armor. Uh, the mech. Okay, so there's that. 41 days. Ooh, it hurts. It hurts a lot, but that's okay. Now, the other thing I want to do is I want to take a look at my Hellcat. This guy can probably go by now. I want to get the LBX out of here. Combined with the ammo. There we go. Um, I mean, I, I could give it another, like, autocannon 5. Or, yeah, it's going to be an Inner Sphere autocannon 5, like, burst fire, whatever. Ah, yes, we have these chain guns. That is also the thing that we want to try out at some point. So now we have two. Hmm. We have three of these, actually. Hold up. Give it a double bin of ammo. Alright. 
And this SRM4 could instead be like an SRM6. Uh, could upgrade a little here. Can we make it an LRM? I would say no, we cannot. We have this MRM. That might be a thing. Get the large laser out of here. Get another medium in there. Mm, I like the build idea already. So, medium laser tier 4, because we can afford it. There we go, we got an MRM. I believe we have ammo for it. Yes, we have two tons. And that is exactly 50. So, AC5, burst fire, MRM20, three medium lasers. So, the projectile weapons got upgraded. Kind of, like, as a, as a whole. Both of them now kind of have the same range. And it has some medium lasers for self-defense close range. I like the idea. Let's go with that. Alrighty. So, Grasshopper. We also need to change that guy. It's just so bad right now. It doesn't really do a lot. You, my friend, you need way more ammunition. Let's go ahead and repair you completely. We have two double bins of LRMs. Um, we certainly need one more. So I believe we can drop a double heatsink. Get this going. Oh god, we have to drop another one. Maybe that's it. Maybe it's good enough. I'm thinking heat bank, maybe. Ah, uh, royal heat sinks. Scary. All right, let's keep one of those in here. The royals are very good, but they're also very heavy. Um, there are no good jump jets that we have. But yeah, I guess that's that's all right. Ammo capacity for this guy to just dump the missiles completely. I like it. So, 18 days. Uh, did we repair? No, we did. There we go. So we got that going. Um, I feel like the Thunderbolt is fine-ish, so we're gonna keep it as is. I also feel like this guy, it's not really doing a lot because it's um, still missing an engine upgrade. We can do so much more with it technically. But it's fine. It's alright, it has the lasers. It's four of them. Double AMS. Seems like an okay build. Okay, so we're just gonna repair this. There's the Black Knight. I know the guys that you are waiting for something big. Uh, let's go also and yeah, assemble that night. Do we do that? We have an atlas to build. We have one Annie and we have an atlas to build. And yes, guys, as much as I also hate it, I think I'm gonna take apart Mr. Mr. Marauder. It's a really good one. Arrow profile plus one evasion. That's pretty good. Um, right structure, more damage, energy cooldown. <sighs> yeah, it is what it is. It is also what it is here in terms of money. Holy crap. We gotta get rid of something. All right, I'll sell the Vindicator. That's the thing that we got kind of for free with the pilot. That thing is not needed at all. The gridiron. We invested into it. Feels bad to drop it now. Um, Shadowhawk is fine still. Maybe we get into some some missions where we want to use that. This one here. I'm gonna take uh, some things apart here, which is the LRMs. They're pretty good. The auto cannon. It's also pretty good. And the engine. And then we're gonna sell that thing. I'll leave everything in there, which which is fine. Okay, and then the Warhawk is gonna be sold. The Cyclops. I'm also not a fan of, honestly. It's a melee assault mag with a claymore. 25% better cooldown, 25% more damage. We could make something happen here. But other than that, the, the quirks are kind of useless. God, I love the big sword, but it's so hard to make happen. So Cyclops... Why are we in Deviant space anyways? Because it's the closest one, huh? Let's go here. Let's go here to another industrial hub. Should have gone there beforehand. I was so hung up on this uh, potential hero mech. Alright, so a little bit of a bummer, but again, no big deal. Is it still Davion? Wait. It's all Davion. Uh, uh huh. So where would we go then? Down here? To Masterson? 
or up here. Oh, this is uh, independent. Okay. Um, God, this is so much. Is it worth it? 72 days? That's like a full financial report. No, it's not. It's certainly not. So, we, we, we have to stay here. Yeah, fine. It's not worth it. This guy here uh, probably wants to get rid of some items. And then we're also going to sell the Hollander. Again, there are some things that we want to prioritize on. Grasshopper, fine. Just repair. It's okay. Good. One more thing. The Hellcat is ready in four days. And that allows us to take a look at our Timberwolf now that I wanted to start building. Uh, actually, we, we started the build already, but we didn't find the ammo, which uh, could be true here. Hold up. Should have checked. Should have checked. Ammo. Nothing on the market. All right. Um, in that case, I will drop the very good LB-10X autocannons of the Inesphere variety, and I'm going to replace them with some mediocre LB-10 uh, clan. But for those, we have ammunition. I will take all the six bins. Mm, maybe. Is five enough? Might be. So we got five medium lasers, we got two LBX autocannons, we have EW countermeasures, 330 rated engine. Cooling is fine, I'd say. Um, we have a ballistic fire control system, which gives us a spread reduction. This guy should probably go on the Annihilator, to be honest. But we have two of them, so that's fine. Uh, yes, so we'll use it here. Alright, we have a nice ballistic Timby. Kind of want an AMS as well. I think AMS on every mech is kind of... It's not a must, but it's a good thing to have. But for that, we had to reduce the... Um, the... Um, the engine rating. Okay. So, my Marauder is a good one. I'll take the engine, because we need more 300 rated cores. Everything else is going to stay, and then we're going to sell that bit. Boy, sorry, Marauder. I like you. I really do. And yes, I think we have tidied up quite good, quite well here. Do we want the Raven? Like, ever? I mean, we could. Cool. Guys, I'm ready. Let's go ahead and seek some trouble. We want to try to go somewhere where we have a... Not a tier 90 mission. There was a... There was a... Yeah, aerospace capture contract. That's good. But you know what? Um, that's a thing that we're going to do later. Because it's a long mission. I want to prepare for that. It's probably going to be something that is maybe a whole episode. Um, we'll do it. But we'll do it later. Right now, I want to play an assassination. It's another fortress. <laughs> oh my god. Why are you doing this to me? I have to accept. Is it a defense? It's another assault. What's it? Mm, 85 this time. It's it's bigger. It's like worse. However, I'll be playing the headhunting mission. Get all the salvage. And in we're going to go. So out of these, which is the worst of them? I really feel like it's the Black Knight. Ah, it has some mobility in form of jump jets. It's four large lasers. It's higher tier large lasers and double regular AMS. This is a royal laser AMS and low tier chemicals. Has one more medium laser. Black Knight has more armor though. Alrighty then. Let's go ahead and play our Timber Wolf. There we go. Did I not build it? Did I... Why did I not... Whoa. I'm confused now. Holy crap. What the hell happened? I guess we are not running the Timby then. But why? Why did that happen? 
I was just so on autopilot that I, I clicked all the buttons and it didn't seem to work. Um, shall we take Annie for a spin? Nah, I want to be mobile. This thing is too slow. All right, I guess we're going to build the Timby next episode then. I don't know what happened. Did I confirm and it didn't happen or did I not confirm it? Um, all right. Cool. I guess that's it. <laughs> Let's play another mission, guys. Oh my god. This is really... I'm really questioning myself now. That's interesting. Weird. Little blackout. Maybe. Again, maybe it was the this game. Bounty is only payable if we bring the entire you know, group to I don't. So you will have to search the area and ensure that everyone... I can only rewatch that later. ...and dealt with before we can pack it in. So the good news is we have more ammunition on our Orion now, which means we can be very easy on the trigger finger and just shoot our missiles left and right. No big deal, no big problem. Um, just use all the missiles early on and just shred these enemies. It's 1400 meters. It's a quite big map. All right, we're gonna approach from the right side. Yeah, and I believe 64 kph is kind of my jam when it comes to uh, even assault max. What we want is like speedy lag actuators. We want maybe superchargers or so, so we can get some nice bursts of speed. Maybe just big engines. I'm not the guy who just rattles over maps like these at 40 kph. It's not fun. We can't all be cultured now, can we? Okay, so one UAV is up already. She doesn't do anything. Friends? Won't be a problem. Yeah, come on. We're here to... Uh-huh. We're here to shred some enemies. Come on, Rihanna. Say it. Looks like we got some bad intel. Our target is not here. Let's hope we have better look at the other locations. Your princess is at another castle. Inbound battle max. All right, Vulcan. Uh, Target of what one. do we have here? A Jenner, a Strider. God, I love that cooldown. Left or right? Left. Yeah, here it comes. It actually has armor. All right, not enough though. These light max or mediums. Mm -hmm. They are the match for me and my firepower. Let's go. The good news is that we can just move from base to base one by one. No big deal. We really need to get our flyer again. Thing was, in fact, really good at distracting enemies. And, um... It's, yeah, it's very valuable in doing that. Once you've found the targeted asset, move up to it, and we'll begin the recovery procedure. I'm getting shot at. Stop it. Sir, this is Flash. Hit. All about I thought me. my teammates had it. That's close enough. Ready to start pickup operation. All right. So we got that thing. Excellent find, Commander. Let's keep going. We got an LRM-10 tier 2. I mean, it's free. So, yeah. Mm, so the second base seems to be on a hill. Got a light the mech. Is in the field, Commander. They're marked on your tactical display. All right, Captain Russell is here. Question is, do we only need to attack one of them, or kill one of them, or is there more? Come on. There we go. We see a stalker it's coming around the corner. It's so nice that you can fire these missiles point blank. Without any reduction in uh, damage. There is no gradual uh, drop off. Oh. Getting slightly toasty. There's one less. Alright, so we have to do more. That's okay. Which variant of a stalker was this? Um. Can't destroy this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If it's the one with the ECM, I would actually be happy to have it. Just for the sake of an ECM. We need to impl implement that, uh, especially in the, our bigger mechs. That matches the class of VTOL we're after. Take uh -huh. it out. We're after VTOLs? Wait. I don't know, man. Are we? Target acquired. Yo, Firestarter, come to play. 
<laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, that little guy. He had it coming. So, next base. Let's go. Still have a bit to walk. Yeah, I'm not really keen on... Mm, Atlas. On hunting down VTOLs. If I get them occasionally and just casually, then I'll take them. LPX, double LRM10, your large laser. You know what? I got a lot of missiles. So in this biome, if I only shoot my missiles, I'm okay in terms of heat buildup. Got our target. All right. Nicely done. Ah, uh, nailed them. All right, are we done? No, we still. What? Airstrike support on the Who are you? Ground, Good. Got the beetle. So we've got a griffin, a panther, and a cicada. This is this is a joke. Come on, guys. Try to leg him. Uh huh. Careful with friendly fire, though. Because our warheads. missiles will have their warheads uh, hot Target as soon as they leave my weapons bay. Right. It's an archer. Yo, buddy, I heard you like missiles. Wanna have some? Oh. Here comes the counter attack. And he's dead. It's looking good. It's looking good. Party's on. And we still have more than half of our ammunition. I think this is the way to go. Dropping a bit of heat management in order to get more sustain on the battlefield. So, last base. Panther. I don't care. He might want to join the fight at some point. What's that? Target acquired. Uh, maybe? That's a kill. Mongoose! Yeah, we cannot hit him unless he's coming out. That's just not okay. Man, this mech is the missile monster. I really feel like we could maybe drop the medium lasers and get more missiles in the mech. Just streamline it completely for missile barrages. But those mediums are very weight efficient, you know? It's just nice to have them to do this when an enemy comes close. There they are, Commander. Take them out and here they are. The hell out of here. All right, can do. I Come on, friends. We have a mission. Let's fulfill it. Yeah, there they are. Battlemaster. Battle Master. Stay in cover. It's the easier game. Oh. Hello. Fire. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, one more? Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Coming up again. Let's deal with the Jenna first. I'm not sure if we got him. No, not quite. But now we did. You know, a UAV would be very nice in this position now. Come on. It's not the most exciting gameplay, I know, but it's a safe one. Are we done? Yeah. Alright. We'll turn around now. We've got an all of them, Commander. There might be Good another, job. like, dropship coming down at some now point. Pack it in before their friends arrive. Yeah. Somebody, somebody, friends arrive? I don't know. Let's just get out of here. It was just a little intermission. Again, I'm sorry, guys, for not being able to play the Timber Wolf. I really need to check back what happened. It might have me being dumb. It might have been the game glitching out. I really felt, also felt like I clicked twice on the repair of the uh, of the grasshopper. I had to confirm it twice. But then again, I'm not entirely sure. Sometimes as a content creator you get distracted, especially when it's not your native language that you're talking in and if you have to like look for words in your head while also have to focus down on what's going on. It's no like excuse, but it's an explanation. Alrighty. Guys, Let's take a look at what we got here. We've got more reputation, an LRM 10, more Atlas, 
It's a double heatsink Atlas. That's a very good LB10 cluster. Ooh, there might be ammo for it here. I have to take a look. That might be the better thing to have anyways. It's a good LRM10, I'll take it as well. Large laser. Just good chunks of high tier weapons. There it is. It's only two tons. It's only two. You know what? We're gonna stop stock up on uh, on double heat sinks, so we have, never have to think about them. And I guess I'll take a medium laser or tier two. Okay. All right. All right. We got this. So, uh, request medical treatment. Using the open will ask the Fortress Commander for medical aid. This is a one-time use and will treat all of your pilots affected by poison or serious wounds. Oh, stop the launch. That's a pretty good one. All right, guys, that has been it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Next time we're going to build a Timby. I hope so. <laughs> we'll see. And if you did, enjoy it and uh, leave a rating, guys. It helps me out a ton as a content creator. Currently, I'm pushing for 100,000 subscribers and we are almost there. So click that subscribe button to help me out a bit. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.